have so many memories as a child at Disneyland. Many were good. I had mostly good memories, but there was a couple times that they were not so good. One time I was just a young child and I was with a group of my classmates and we were all goofing off. And we, they used to have this sky tram. It's they're not there no more. And we were going over the park and we would drop like licorice and little candies on people. And people were like, ah, you know, children, they do stupid stuff. And I was no different. And I remember getting off this ride and the security was waiting for me. And they said, we've had reports of you dropping licorice and stuff on people's heads. And then they put us into this like room and they called our parents and they had us come pick us up. And I was really scared. I was just a young child. I didn't think I was doing any bad. But of course, that wasn't good, dropping a little licorice. I didn't hurt nobody, but still, it wasn't nice. So we got a little bit of mischief at Disneyland also. At Disneyland, you walk a lot. You're walking all day long, and then you're looking for a ride where you can sit down and you could just chill for a few minutes, rest your feet, because they hurt. And one of the rides was the monorail. It was like a little rail that would go through the park. And it was nice. You go through different areas and see different things. It was really nice. And it was a nice chill to relax and to just rest <laughs> your feet. And it was kind of an early day tram. The monorail started in the middle near the water area where the submarines are. And it would go around the park on the uh, parking lot. And it would go all the way to the Disneyland Hotel. And then you'd get out there and walk around the hotel for a while. And it was a nice hotel. There wasn't that many hotels back then. And then after you're bored going through the shops and stuff, you'd get back on the monorail and you'd head back to Disneyland. And it was really a fun ride. And another ride was the People Mover. That was an early day ride also. That was kind of ahead of its time. You'd get on it and you'd just cruise around the park a little bit. And it was nice, you know, you got to see some, got to ride in some different attractions and see them. But it was just a nice way to rest your feet, to chill, to feel the fresh air. And it was just like nice being in those days. Another ride was the go-karts, you know, we used to ride those go-karts. And having been a motorcycle racer uh, for my life, I always enjoyed the cars and the motorcycles. And they had the car racing, Utopia. And you'd go there, and I'd always go on Autopia every day, and I would be racing and stuff. It was so much fun, and I got a lot of my early day excitement of being a racer, probably from that Autopia. It was fun, and a lot of these early day events, they shaped my life, and they were very special also.